Although it's loved, these days the gollywog is also controversial. Sam Watson from the University of Queensland says gollywogs are offensive to Indigenous Australians. It seems the company's gollywog isn't to everyone's taste. Not the best possible taste, I'd say. Um... This is an absolute slur on these creatures that have been around for very many years that were created to be friends of young people as they were friends of mine. It is absolutely nothing to do with politically incorrect. It's political correctness gone mad. While some say the dolls are racist, Honky Tonk Doll Collector Reuben Govender sees things differently. Look, I don't think these dolls are offensive at all. These dolls have been in my family for years. I think it's just political correctness gone mad. I mean, people get offended at anything these days. But they have got stereotypical white features, white skin, frilly dresses. Look, these, these, doll, this, these dolls, not, the Honky Tonk dolls are not racist. Well, my, uh, my, my grandmother was very fond of the, the Honky Tonk dolls uh, in the 1950s. And uh, she started out with one or two. And as you can see, uh, I've expanded the collection uh, quite, uh, quite significantly. I've invested a huge part of my life savings into these dolls. Despite the criticism, Reuben plans to increase his collection and maybe even open a honky-tonk doll museum for the public. While some people might be offended, there's at least one doll collector who feels he's doing the white thing. Love Mom.